Hello and welcome to Minecraft Tips and Tricks with Bunyo Banya. Never put your chest right in front of your door, because when you meet Mr. Creeper, that's the first thing that's going to blow up. A better place to hide your chest would be in a tunnel. It would never explode. Unlike your little chest in front of your face. Wow, charge creepers explode. Another tip would be never go near a charge creeper. Make an underwater house? Well, you can. Because of a glitch, ladders block out all water. So you can just place one like that, and it'll keep out all the water. It also keeps out mobs. Because mobs have an instinct to swim upward. Other than slimes, of course, but they don't spawn on the surface. See? It would never sink down into your house. Very good protection. Right, with no protection, no worries. Just dig down a few blocks and place a block over you. May not be the most entertaining thing, but you'll never get hurt down in your little safe haven. And if you have a torch, it's even better. Just occasionally do that, and you can see when day comes. When day does come, just get back to your business. You know that you can make huge jungle trees? Just place four jungle tree saplings in a little square like that, and put bone meal on it. It'll grow into a luscious giant jungle tree. Making a melon farm? Or a pumpkin farm? Be sure to know that the melons and pumpkins grow to the side. So a farm like this could never produce any melons. A more appropriate farm would be this. See? Look at how prosperous our melon sprouts are. And melons are a very good food source, one of the best in the game. But sadly, they can only be found in something called abandoned mine shafts. Got a brewing stand? Let me show you how to make two very essential potions. To make a healing potion, you just brew like this. The nether wart is first. Just put it in the little thing first. When that's done, put the glistering melon into it for next, and then put the glowstone dust into it. The glowstone dust is optional, but it makes it stronger, which can heal you a lot more. And to make a splash potion of poison, just take the healing potion that you made, brew one of these into it, a fermented spider eye, and some gunpowder. The gunpowder will turn it into something called a splash potion, which you can throw at mobs to hurt them. To craft the fermented spider eye and the glistering melon, just take the gold nugget and the melon to make a gl glistering melon. And to make a fermented spider eye, just take a spider eye, a brown mushroom, and some sugar. And that will make one of those. Nether warts can be found in nether warts. Hey, that rhymes. Well, being that this video now has ten clips, or nine clips, I think that's enough. Want more tips or tricks? Leave a comment below. I hope to see you guys again. Bunyo out.